another package. Let's see what's in the package. This is actually an upgrade to the Volt Chevy Volt charging system. Would you look at that? There's a user's guide. So basically, this is a charger that I got for the car. And it's a dual charger, or it's supposed to be a dual charger. It charges on two voltages. 120 and 240. This is a charger that everybody wanted from the start, but nobody made. If you wanted both, you would have to have both. It doesn't make sense why they never made this charger from the beginning. But I guess there's maybe reasons for that. Safety reasons and all that. Alright, let's see. There we go. It's a pretty small guy, looks like. And it's by a company called EV Institute. EV Institute. EVI. So that's pretty cool. Whoa, this, this cable seems pretty thick here. Alright, let's see. Alright, so here's what we get. Oh, here we go. There's some adapters and stuff. Okay, I guess this is the... Uh, this is the 240 adapter. So I'm guessing this comes from the charger into here. And then you got the 120 adapter. And then you got the charger itself. Which is this little guy. He's pretty light, actually. It doesn't weigh much. Most of this weight is cables, I think. So, it looks pretty weather weatherproofed, all this. And I don't think it's completely waterproof, but who knows? I'm sure it's made for outdoors. And this is nice handle here. And this should fit every electric car, technically on the market um, or this is the standard whatever it's called I forgot the name for this plug but this is what all the electric cars has the normal ones so yeah it looks pretty awesome for what you get and this I think this is 18 feet long which is nice this is a lot thicker than the original volt uh, uh, wire so that's kinda interesting Alright, so on the charger end of it, or the power, or this is the output here. This is the plug that's for the output. I guess it's kind of like a universal RV plug or something. I'm not sure, but it's one of these plugs. And then you take your whatever adapter you want. So I'm going to use 120. And you plug it into here. I guess somehow. Here we go. Gotta find the right way to get it in there. If I can get it in there, there we go. And then after you plug that, and then you can plug it into the socket. So essentially, what you got here is this. So you can use either the 240 plug or the 120. And you just got one charger. I wonder why they didn't make this from the beginning. <sighs> so this is actually a really good investment because you can take this thing anywhere you want and whenever there's a 240, you can plug into 240. So, but a lot of times if you're going somewhere, you don't have a 240, you have the M120. And whenever you're at home, you can use the 240. That's what you got. So your car charges fast. And then when you go on a vacation somewhere and you want to charge at a hotel or some friend's houses or whatever you go on family, you charge with this guy. You can still get charged. So pretty awesome. Let's unravel this guy and see what it looks like. Alright, so it looks like a standard handle. Definitely feels heavy duty. There's a little clicker here. You can hear the click. I wonder if there's a button that does something. It does have a cap on here. That's pretty cool. Okay, so I don't think it has a light in there. Let's plug this thing in and see what it what it shows up. And it looks like it's got a little display here. 
it's really small but and some kind of indicating light too we can see what that looks like all right something lit up it says 16 amp ready so it's pretty cool it has looks like it tracks your time and how much kilowatts you used I don't know if you guys will be able to see anything there with the refresh rate but yeah everything looks good let's plug it in and see what if the volt takes it alright so here we got a 2012 Chevy Volt let's plug it in and see what happens hopefully it'll take charge and there it goes the yellow lights on and there goes the green so perfect now if we go back to the thing you can see here this thing would focus the red light came on I'm guessing this is power this is means it's charging and then this means something's wrong with it probably this triangle I haven't read the instructions there's not much to read there's no buttons here or anything so I'm guessing it's all automatic so you just plug it in and you got yourself some charging and it's charging at 11.8 amps which is the maximum I think for the volt but yeah it's right at 12 amps right now so basically 1.2 kilowatts it's drawing from the uh, I guess source um, I'm not able to try the 240 right now because I don't have access to that but when I do I will make a video of that so yeah it's pretty awesome charger alright guys so everything is good it's showing here that it's charging on 120 volts and it'll be done at 2.45 a.m. which is forever alright guys just want to show you this is the stock volt charger the 120 and I want to show you the length of these cords so the difference is this cord here is pretty thin just like here but this one after this is really thin or a lot thinner but the one after this you can tell how much thicker that is I guess because it's made for higher uh, ratings because Volt doesn't need this this high of a rating I guess uh, the amperage I think the maximum is only 12 amps or whatever it is so this is enough but this is for all electric cars so this is a universal charger but here's the thing the length is exactly the same which I think is 18 feet total I think as you can see the volt, original volt might be a bit longer but by a hair so it comes with a pretty good uh, user guide here it tells you everything about the charger the plugs and stuff and all the information about all this is so that's pretty cool some troubleshooting guides and stuff like that which could be useful so I'm gonna put this in the uh, trunk of the Volt so I don't lose it alright guys so this is the EV Institute dual charger which is pretty awesome so I think I'm gonna be really happy I hope it lasts it was a pretty decent price for compared to what you can get with chargers these days so I think it's a great deal so and there's a lot of good information on here which I think a lot of people will appreciate for sure so anyways pretty pretty awesome um, I mean I don't really have any uh, things bad to say about it so far but I guess we'll do an update video eventually but yeah so far I would say I definitely recommend it for over a little bit over three hundred dollars on Amazon this thing is a good choice no matter what kind of electric car you got this thing will deliver and definitely one of my favorite things about it is this handle I really like the the white handle it looks awesome my car is white so it matches kind of the uh, of the car so pretty cool so yeah guys well thanks for watching this video and hopefully it was useful if you are looking for a dual voltage charger where you can plug in 240 or 120 on the same charger this is your charger so definitely highly recommend it all right, well, thanks for watching, and please hit the subscribe button to see more videos. Peace.